So, Russia in one, Brazil two, Trinidad and Tobago in three, United States in four, France five, Jamaica six, Nigeria seven, Ukraine in eight. It's a rerun on the anchor leg of the 200 metres final. If it's tight, we have Carmelita Jetta on the anchor leg for the States and Veronica Campbell-Brown, who took that 200 metre gold a few nights ago in fine style. Trinidad in three, United States in four, France five and Jamaica six. The final of the women's four by 100 metre relay. Will we see some fireworks from the Americans? Well, Shelley Ann Fraser Price will hope to get away very, very quickly for the Jamaicans. Povis going well on the outside. And Shelley Ann Fraser Price going really well on that first leg. Fairly clean changeover to Karen Stewart. The Americans need to come back with Alison Felix, and they're doing so. Alison Felix is running a brilliant leg. Then Sharon Simpson for Jamaica. Have the Americans left it too late? The Ukrainians going well on the outside. Jetta against Campbell Brown and Carmelita Jetta. Can she hang on? Veronica Campbell Brown is coming, but it's going to be another gold for the Americans. Carmelita Jetta takes it 41 5 7, just two tenths of a second outside the world record. And Carmelita Jetta brought them home in fine, fine style. We thought it might come down to a duel and a rerun of that 200 metre final between Jetta and Veronica Campbell Brown. And this time it was gold for the United States. A lightning quick time, Michael Johnson. Great performance, great handoff. We've talked about this US team on the men's and women's side having so much pressure on them because they've had so many drop batons in the past. There's been lots of money spent to develop this team to get practices in, to get training camps in, meets in where they could work on these handoffs, and they finally got it right. There was pressure coming for, from Veronica Campbell-Brown from Jamaica, but Carmelita Jetta, the 100-meter world champion, just holding off Veronica Campbell-Brown. They knew they would need to be quick, but they would need to have great handoffs, and they've been able to do that tonight. A great performance, tight at the line, the Jamaicans were coming. I think it all Marsha Bet Myers and Allison Felix in the middle of that race on second and third leg made all of the difference. This is Bianca Knight. Not a great start this time. She got a really good start in the prelims earlier today. But in this race in the final, she didn't get out as good. Shelly Ann Fraser got a, a little bit of a head start, I believe, on her. In terms of the, the exchange here, let's just look. Yep, they touched off just ahead of the Americans, but Allison Felix, who has had an extremely busy week here with the 200 meters, 400 meters, four by 400 meter relay, made up some ground on the second leg there. Let's check out this handoff. Perfect. That's a great handoff, full extension by the outgoing runner, Marsha Vett Myers and Allison Felix. Myers ran a blistering turn in the prelims and again here. In the final, the Jamaicans just touching out just a bit earlier. But the Americans were in front. And Carmelita Jetta just smooth, great technique coming down the home stretch. All she's got to do now is hold off the fast closing, Veronica Campbell Brown. Carmelita Jetta just taking a look over there to the side. She knows that's where the heat's going to come from. It's going to come from the Jamaicans. It's going to come from Veronica Campbell Brown, a great 100 meter and 200 meter sprinter. But she's happy to get that victory. Well, what a marvellous performance from the Americans. And I tell you what, the Jamaicans ran their socks off. National record and a Commonwealth record in second place. And a really good finish by Stewie of the Ukraine to bring them home with the bronze. So four medals to Alison Felix now. The United States take it with a lightning quick time. Jamaica, a national record, but silver this time and a brilliant bronze for Ukraine.